An NYPD sergeant suspended tonight after the attorney general's office says he threw a picnic cooler at a motorcyclist who was trying to run from police, ultimately causing his death. Let's get the latest now from Stephanie Rattini, who is live in University Heights tonight. Steph. Steve, friends and family are clearly devastated. They've set up a makeshift memorial here as they mourn the sudden death. It's my only brother, said Erica Dupree Soto. She and her family are devastated over the loss of Eric Dupree. The New York Attorney General's office is investigating his death, confirming an NYPD officer threw a picnic cooler at Dupree, who was riding a motorbike, and that the cooler hit him, causing him to fall on the ground. He was later pronounced dead. No we don't accept it. We can't believe that police that supposedly will protect us, that take care of us, are the ones that kill us, said his older sister. Police sources say it was a buy and bust operation, basically an undercover drug sting. Police sources say an officer identified as Sergeant Eric Duran was forced to throw an object to stop a man fleeing on a motorcycle. Friends and family are gathering by a makeshift memorial. It happened in Kingsbridge Heights, a neighborhood in the Bronx on Aqueduct Avenue near West 190th. In a statement released on social media, the NYPD said early today, New York City Police Department Sergeant Eric Duran was suspended from duty without pay following a fatal incident in the Bronx on Wednesday afternoon involving a man attempting to flee from the police on a motorcycle. No kidding, they don't want to talk, said Dupree Soto when asked what the family has been told by police. Eric Dupree was a father of three young children and a husband. La gente está the community is impacted, said his sister. From the Bronx and from a Puerto Rican family, his death is clearly impacting those he leaves behind. Steve, back to you inside. All right, thanks, Stephanie.